What's going on guys? This is DVS from the present day and you're about to watch a Back to the Future episode. And what that is, is I kept filming when we started the channel in 2021, but I did not keep posting or editing the videos. So I've got probably 10 to 20, I don't even know. There's a bunch in this phone, hanging out, taking a bunch of memory. So for cool flashbacks, we're gonna go ahead and release these slowly but surely. There is two other episodes. There's a playlist on, on this, so check that out for the other two. One is uh, Winnemucca, Nevada and Lake Tahoe. So a couple out of towners as well. This one is a Yakima uh, and a different car, uh, less gray hair, didn't live in the car. Three years ago, guys, it's a whole different ball game. So there'll be a lot of references, a lot of things that I probably don't do. It's a little shakier. I'm a lot better with hold the camera, things like that. So throw a comment in there. Let me know what you think. Please watch it as long as you can or just leave it on. Help me make some of the YouTube nice ad money. I would appreciate it. And I hope you all enjoy. Got a couple of these coming out here slowly but surely, but this was August 27th of 2021. Sit back and relax, and I will too, because I haven't watched or edited anything yet. Wow. So I am back. Peeps, you can tell my voice is a little hoarse. <clears throat> it's an acid reflux thing, not sick. So I just picked up that uh, prescription order for 33 bucks. That's freaking crazy. Script, I'm headed to the first customer now. And uh, I just so happened to be right by my coffee shop. So... Why not pick up a nice coffee? And we'll get these scripts delivered here. So guys, I got a little bit of better of a voice now. Just had a laryngitis thing. I got two more left. So each one has been $6.75. No tips or anything. I'm assuming just DoorDash just pays it out or, or what. I'm not quite sure how this whole process works on their end, but I mean, I'll take these all day long for that. Um, I think I'm only at about 30 minutes or less. And I did just take an Instacart order for 35 bucks, I think, or 39 bucks. It's uh, like a 30 mile, so it's pretty far, but it's midday now where it starts dying off and uh, there isn't much going on. As you can see, I got the other phone now, so I've got two phones. Use that one. Oh shit, the address is in there. All right, I left it, and so you guys can see, I've got another phone now. <clears throat> Here goes my voice again, damn it. You're gonna go bleep. And see, there you go, 675. No tip, but I mean, five orders at 675 and shit. So I'm less than an hour for 30 some bucks. And about 20 of those minutes was getting to the thing. And you gotta remember I got coffee. So I had to take this. I've never seen, that is the biggest DoorDash. I mean, I've seen them on other people's channels and stuff where they're you know like 70 bucks and they're million stop walmarts or something like that but i've never seen uh in my town that's the biggest one ever so i just piqued my curiosity oh, there you can see you got 33.75 by completing deliveries you accepted so that was pretty sweet in shot i i just you just seen you can see that I need to go get my delivery. Like I said, I knew I was getting pretty close. It's been about 30 minutes for the Instacart. So um, that's at least one cool thing. They kind of let you, you can take one a little bit early while you're completing some other stuff. And then that way you, um, you know, you're not completely like wasting your time. 
and that's the best thing that I've noticed lately, and that's another the reason why I haven't filmed, is I literally just stack orders after orders, and um, just a few minutes before each one, you know, you turn on either an Uber or uh, DoorDash or an Instacart, and it's just like one after another after another, so it's super hard to film. I do have two phones now, uh, but that one I'm only, I only run DoorDash specifically. All right, everybody. Go and do our favorite place. Can you guess what it is? Where I go all week, all the time. Three or four times a day, which nobody ever wants to go to. Can you guess? Of course you are, because you just watched the other parts, so you know. Super busy, always. Can't even get a goddamn parking spot usually. Oh my god, there's one. Oh, look, I'm talking shit. Well, we're like super close. Can't beat that, that's way too close. So I actually didn't get the initial other, um, Instacart, so that one didn't went away because I took too long, of course, which I don't suggest. So you got to be really careful because you only get so much percentage you can mess with too. But literally, I lucked out and right away another one that was in town, so I don't have to drive far. Which I was kind of looking forward to being on the road and getting some AC, but uh, another one came up for forty-one bucks. So two orders, it's like 25 or 30 items. So I'm gonna go pull that. I did not screenshot it because in my town, Instacarts literally pop up and go away in seconds. Even like shit ass, like freaking $8 bullshit, whatever, they freaking take them like so fast. Um, And it's been really slow today. I've only actually seen about six or seven instacarts in total even come up and i have early access uh, because of your rating and um, acceptance and stuff so craziness but i'm gonna get in there and get this instacart that'll put us at like 70 some dollars for less than three hours by the time i'm done i'm at about a little over an hour right now It's about an hour and a half later, and I am completing the second Costco order, dropping it off. One thing about my Costco that really sucks is they do not help you with separating the items. So if you have two orders and you go up, hey, I got two orders, you know, you split it up on the belt, and they fucking take all of it and put it all in the same goddamn, you know, it's all in the same cart, but they just throw it in the same boxes and stuff. So annoying. I'm still working on getting faster at the grocery. I am not the fastest, so. But, you know, done and it'll be done right. So that's the most important, I would think. That's what I would want. Well, let's get this done and we'll go back on DoorDash here. All right, got the Costco dropped off and we're right around three hours and uh, sitting at I don't know the exact total, but that one was, I believe, 42, 41 something. So we'll call it 42 bucks. And then we've got 33.75 from DoorDash. So we're gonna say about $75. So, is that 20, 40, 60? It's over 20 bucks an hour. Oh, duh. Uh, 25 times three, geez, man. Where's my simple math? It's 25. I stopped counting and doing the uh, per hour stuff just because I, in my town lately, the food has been so bad. And with the groceries, I'm not so like super fast where I make the, the per hour like super efficient. 
I'm just more worried about hitting my goal for the day dollar amount wise whether or not that you know takes me three hours or it takes me you know six so my goal lately has only been about a hundred maybe 125 bucks and um it's kind of struggle even to get that sometimes i mean today was good with those two big but usually i'll get about one good 30 dollar one or something and then the door dashes are just like 20 30 minutes in between it's crazy it's a dramatic slowdown so i don't know what the hell's going on i think it might, maybe there's just way more drivers now but i've done probably about 75 percent instacart and that's another reason why i'm not doing as much filming it's hard to you know do that when you're using the phone to pull groceries and shit i need to get another phone or another camera or an actual camera or something but also, once if the channel grows or whatever. On a Sunday afternoon. I got a badass little, well, it's not a badass. It's an okay little order here. I should have done so you can see the utility helper. I'll try to get the next one where she talks if you guys haven't seen it on uh, UGMs. Uh, check so as you out. can see, it shows uh, the 25 minutes is when it's due. 3.33 a mile and shows the pickup there. It's a $10 order for three miles. 7-Eleven in a local spot. There's two miles. I think we're missing her now. So, out doing another Costco. And this one only had uh, five or six items for Instacart, and it was around 20 bucks. It was like 14 or 16 miles, so it was a little far, but uh, I squeezed a couple other deliveries before that. Uh, I got a Uber in there and uh, a $10 DoorDash, which was the one before here, so... Not too bad, and uh, it's out here in the boonies. There's lots of boonie areas around me, so I'll show you. out you know three forty dollar order I mean that's 
120 a day just doing that. And not having to worry about waiting at restaurants and if the food's ready and canceling and whatever, all that. So, I don't know. Sometimes I like to do a little bit more. But definitely going to go back there and make some do. So, see how long this takes us. It's about 6.08. I'm just coming back in. We got lots of fires right now, or a big fire. So we got that orange freaking sun going on. And you can see all the smoke. I was here about 10 minutes before the pickup time, so just went on my phone for a little bit. Some jack hole behind me got his freaking brights on in the parking lot like a weirdo. And yes, we have to wear masks again here. They make us everywhere. They just started a couple days ago again. Whoa, whoa. Let's go get this bad boy delivered and see if it's more than the little minimum 675 that seems to be now I don't know let me guys let, let me uh, know in the comments because that's my new minimum basically or the the top is uh, used to be 850 or eight dollars and then you'd expect you know sometimes you'd have the other tip or whatever uh, now almost everything on DoorDash comes through a 675 or 575 and then I've even had them um, like six dollars and then they're hiding like five up to like fifteen dollar tips on six dollar orders now so keep an eye out but let's see what this one's gonna be man this new I just got the iPhone uh, 12 Pro Max and man this thing looks clear and it is huge huge bump and so nice compared to the old 8 Plus with the little button on the bottom Go 
hot, they actually turn their light on. Hello, how's it going? It's hot for you. Thank you, have a great night. All right, we handed it to customer, and I got video proof, so we're good. And 675. It's actually super nice to do some food delivery, uh, and not having to do the whole freaking grocery. I mean, grocery pays good; it's been paying the bills, so I love it for that. But you know, doing food is just so much easier. <laughs> Uh, just a whole different world. It's got its perks, you know. Food with the food, you know. I feel like you can. Uh, I just put my uh, earphones in and jam out, and go pick your stuff and whatever. But I mean, you can do that with. Uh, I mean, the grocery orders. You can do that with, uh, you know, DoorDash and stuff too. But you know, just have one little bag instead of like a whole trunk full of shit. But, you know, like you're only plucking away seven bucks at a time, not like 40 like that last one. So I'll throw some screenshots up here of uh, my Instacart. So I pulled over a hundred on Instacart today. And uh, we're just gonna keep going until it stops being busy. My town on Friday, about 10, is the latest you can really go. Maybe about 10.30, everything closes by 11. All it's open McDonald's. And because everything's short staffed, you'll just be sitting your ass in the freaking drive through waiting forever. We're going to cruise over to Applebee's and we'll hang out right over here. And usually they get some pretty decent orders with quite a few extra tips sometimes. So we'll see what we're looking at here. There she is, and uh, we'll sit over here in the quiet part of the parking lot. Every 10 minutes, and then if not, and it's almost, it's about 8.30 something, so then we'll head over to Red Robin in the nicer part of town, like where the wealthy people are. And uh, there'll be a lot more orders over there. My town's, like I said before, really rotates around the, you know, social security, welfare, benefits, unemployment, stuff like that. A lot of stuff on the first. So towards the end of the month, people aren't ordering and doing nothing. It's, it's tight out here. Oh, we got a new broke shit. Here, here we go. Let's see if she talks. Oh no, because it's a shit order. So three seventy-five. 64 cents a mile. Fuck you, piece of shit. Tip a dollar. Seriously. Oh my god. And that's not even literally, that's through like a pass thing. That's on the other side of town. So stupid. Look at this. One button decline. Watch this. Bye. That's your driver utility app. No selecting a stupid ass fucking reason. None of that. God, it's so worth it. Just hit that. It literally takes off like cup quite a few clicks a day. And you guys know with all that junk coming through there. So we'll go over that more later. I want to catch her talking. We'll see. Who is she going to talk? $7. Incoming order from Applebee's Grill Plus Bar. Total miles 4.1. Current price seven dollars. Price per mile one dollar and seventy one cents. Hell yes, we'll take that. I told you guys, isn't that the coolest fucking thing? So awesome, hey, but you have to have Android. Oh, babies. Good, good. I got one for the Mary Sue. Mary. Hey, Mr. Dave. 
Something's weird on this. I don't know what the hell. Sorry for the video. Yeah, it's a little funky here, these pickups and stuff, so I'm not sure, but I think it looks to be like I did a, a triple dirty here, um, and we're picking up a Famous Dave's and another order, and we already have the Applebee's, but Hawks play right, more so than Clip. we got both of them in the red bags here. So this one was a double order for 15 bucks, as you can see. The other one is Dairy Queen downtown, and it is a bitch to get in there. And it's just a couple blizzards, so I'm gonna cancel it, and it's going the other way. And with DoorDash, because I've got a couple violations in the time that you guys haven't seen me, and. You've got to be with your time. So picking up, uh, like doing this is not too bad at Famous Dave's because it's across the street. But if you're going to go in a whole nother area and try to pick up and do all that shit, it's just not worth it. You, you can't make their deadline. to show you guys this function here so we're gonna press and hold it and then you can move these wherever you want okay front door thank you have a good night complete get the delivery yeah whatever it's fine Nice, nice big fatty tip. Thank you, thank you. Come again. Trash, 375. I mean, it's only at one point some miles. I have this, uh, I have some old videos on that KFC. Fuck that place. Oops, here, it's nothing. This place never fucking done. It's never done. I ended up the day at about 2.33 for 10 and a half hours or so, 10 hours. So it's over 20 bucks an hour and uh, pretty good day for sure. So uh, glad to be back doing some videos. I will get this out as soon as I possibly can. And uh, I'm gonna run some numbers after this so you guys will see afterwards and uh, please subscribe down below. Let me know if you made it all the way through. Give me a thumbs up in the comments. I appreciate all of you. Have a great night. Thanks for watching. Well, it's devious from the present day before I got ready for the day. So there you go. There's without hair gel. Well, kind of just combed it. Anyways. Same sweater, huh? <laughs> Shows you how I've been doing. Uh, video's kind of weird, yeah. There's all over the place. Man, compared to how I film now, it's completely different. I can tell, you know, I know I use so a lot. I know I'm probably butt and stuttered. And this is early days of filming. Definitely not used to doing the camera and stuff as much back then. And... These are when I used to do beast days before I was completely burned out and I had a car that could keep up doing all day. That car blew up, by the way, the motor blew up. That's the Kia. Look at these numbers. <laughs> I went, and, good thing I used Gridwise. $63 on DoorDash, 105 on Instacart, and what, I think 
53 or 54 on Uber. Crazy. 161 miles in one day. This was during the, the heydays, guys. I mean, it had a, went down quite a bit from, you know, COVID, COVID times, but it's way better than anything now. And I don't know if any of those numbers are achievable. I haven't done any really long days like that. This car can't, and I can't keep up with that these days. But we'll see. I don't know. Maybe we'll knock some of those out once we get some rest and different rig. But crazy day. I, I didn't get a lot of the deliveries and stuff, but I appreciate y'all hanging out. Again, this is just a flashback. I'm trying to clear some of my hard drive and never been released before. And found it interesting for sure.